hi welcome back to the channel so today i'm just going to show you how i make it to placement so this is how i make it i take the bus i will get the bus then i get to the train station then I, because this was on sunday it's kind of difficult getting a train on early on time so i just wanted to see whether i could make it by nine o'clock to for my placement so i was here at eight then I got to the train station. I was just trying to, I was just hoping that I'll be able to get a train on time. So here's me in the platform, just trying to see whether I could rush and get a train. So I just, I was just walking fast at this point. So I met one of the workers and I asked him, was a train going to come on Sunday at this time? And he said, no, it's just a tram. So he directed me to where I could get a tram. Then I had to go back. And here, I was just nagging and complaining. <laughs> if you know me, you know me. I was just nagging and complaining that why, why is all this happening on Sundays? So I said, let me quickly rush because I had just had a tram stop i was like let me rush before this tram goes because on sundays it's kind of hard getting on a tram on time so i just jumped onto the tram as soon as i saw it i just jumped onto it and i was happy that it was going to where i was supposed to go and get another train so here was me just complaining and telling you how my experiences are going because I struggled to get a bus early, I struggled to get a tram early. And this is all what we nursing students nurses we face when we are going for placements and we are supposed to be on time. So here is Manchester Piccadilly just on my way there. Then some people had to alight for and I noticed that it was this way I was supposed to get down. So I quickly got down from the tram and I started walking to get a train because the train and the tram are on the same place are in the same place. So I had to just hurry up and get it. So here I was just checking what time the train was going to come, whether I should start running or I should start walking. So I noticed I still had enough time, so I just took my time took my time so here we are now in victoria manchester victoria so this is where i'm going to get my next train to bolton so there's me me walking me 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 that was me i was just checking what time the train was um sorry the train was about to come then i started moving yeah, so I got here and the, <laughs> it didn't want, it didn't allow me enter, so I had to try another yeah, and I got into the platform. So I just now got into the platform and I found where I was supposed to get my train. So I was just sitting here alone. I was the only one here at that time. So I was just sitting alone taking my videos and also telling you guys how I'm feeling as a nursing student and hey welcome back again to my channel so um this was part two of where we stopped so right now we got into the train then i got myself a seat then i was just telling you guys i've gotten onto the train around 10 and i don't know the time i'm going to get to work yes yeah, so i was just nagging and telling you guys what was going on so here was we now moving we left so we are now heading to Bolton, then just showing you guys. So then I was now showing you guys the place and how beautiful Manchester is. So here I was, I was on the train just checking my emails and also responding to messages I've not been able to respond to for some time. So that's what I was just doing, just checking it then. I saw this ticket man who started, he was talking to me, so we're just laughing. Yeah, then I had got, I got to Bolton and I was supposed to rush to the hospital. So this was me just telling you the time I have just got there. And I was just checking to see whether it was raining or not, because you can never, you can never imagine, you just be there and it starts to rain anytime. So I was just about to get down from the train and start running. So I just got down from the train. Then I started running, walking fast because 
I couldn't be bothered at this time because I'm late already. No matter how I ran, I'm still going to be late. So I just took my time and I just walked to the platform where I could just show my ticket and get out of the train station. So that's what I did. Then I was just telling you guys how things were going. Yeah, I couldn't just believe that I was still... <laughs> At this time and i'm still now going to work like everyone knows i'm always on time so i can't be bothered <laughs> that's what i was just telling you i can't be bothered at all yeah so this was me just still walking 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 i was just walking and also telling you guys what's going on so here i was now on the platform almost about to get out of the place but i just wanted you to know like this was what's going on and all that so i was still just walking and just letting you guys know how things are going so here was where i just had to scan my ticket and get out so as soon as I got out, I got an Uber because I had already booked an Uber. So that was my Uber that came and picked me and just taking me straight to work. So here I'm at work. Thank you. We are in the train station and it's telling me what we're talking today. Okay, let's go. I don't want them to beat me. So let's go home. Let Debra say hi to you. See my rough face. She is tired. She has gone to inject people and now her hands are all pain in here. I did this for her seven weeks. Every, do you know it's more than sorry, bye. I was thinking and I was and I was Okay. Okay. Yeah.